There are lots of causes of rashes in children, and one of the most common is a virus infection. But for instance, among the other ones are heat rashes, where you have a well child and itchy little red bumpy spots. Chickenpox, where you'll have a poorly child who has blisters, often what we describe as a teardrop and a rose petal, so a blister with red skin underneath. Eczema, which is red, dry, and itchy, intensely itchy. Hives, which is a bit like nettle rash, otherwise known as urticaria. So-called slapped cheek syndrome, which is caused by a virus where you get bright red, like a scalding on your face, accompanied by fever and symptoms of a cold, or hand, foot and mouth disease, where you have blisters on the hand and in the feet and inside your mouth, although those can be difficult to see. I've mentioned viral infections. Some of the ones we've already talked about are viral, but actually on the whole, the most common is a viral infection, we don't know what kind. Your child is often fairly grisly, they can have a mild fever, but really important to check that your child doesn't have one of the infections that could be really serious. So for instance, if your child has a rash that doesn't fade if you press a glass against it, if they have a stiff neck, don't like the light, if they're confused, if they have convulsions, if they're boiling hot all over but have freezing cold hands and feet, if they can't control their fever or they're shaking uncontrollably, then you must call 999. If your child has a rash with a fever, again, there's a good chance it's a simple viral illness that will settle, but it is important to check out our separate information on fever to see and assess whether there is any possible reason that they might need urgent medical help.